So what we have to remember when we talk about this volume is that the height is still from the middle of the base to the apex here, right? That's still the height. It's not the slant height, it's the overall height. So the volume of the pyramid is one-third the base, the area of the base times the height. And same over here, the volume of a cone is one-third pi r squared h. So whatever the volume of the cylinder would be, that's the volume of the cone. And that happens for, you know, um, pyramids of different area of base as well. So that's, um, it, it's the same relationship. It's always, the volume is always one third. Okay? So let's say we have, um, well, but just right, just if we have something like this. So if you, if this is a, um, actually, how many sides does this have here? You count them. Okay, six. So what sort of base shape is that? Six sides. Yeah, it's hexagon, right? Okay, so this would be a hexagonal pyramid. Okay. And um, so, yeah, so the volume of any pyramid would be one-third the area of the base, okay, times the height. So that's your general, your general pattern there for the area of a pyramid. Now, that's, of course, a right pyramid. So that's, you know, a right one. It's not, if it's not forming a right angle here, and this doesn't, doesn't necessarily hold true.